structures get us scratching our heads, thankfully we have superstar engineer Yuwande to call on for help. Yuwande, ah! Yuwande! Hi! Hi we guys! We need your help. Okay. Big time. Alright, you've come to the right place. We're trying to recreate the world's tallest building. Okay. The Burj Khalifa. Oh, good. But we want to build it out of straws. Out of straws? How do we do that? Because, right. you know, if you're putting straws one on top of another, yes. five metres high, okay. it's just going to fall over. Exactly it? right. We already know Basil Khan's amazing idea yes. of actually putting the support mechanism oh, of the outside. building yes, around the outside. Really exactly. Like that, yeah. but, but he had another idea. Right, so his idea was pretty much bundling up structures together. We're flowing around a curved surface forms what you call vortices and they're pretty much like spirals right they just keep on going round and round and round and round living in downtown shanghai it's so easy to see how much energy is consumed on a daily basis in this city alone population has grown to 24 million people that is why this country needs more energy of the two turbine buildings and just listen to that that is the sound of huge quantities of water traveling at up to 80 miles per hour a futuristic concept currently unique in the world the thing that's different and very unique about the maglev is the fact that it floats it hasn't got any wheels, it floats across the guideway all the way to the airport. Now the maglev is just about to pull out of the station. When it's at its top speed, it would be moving at 431 kilometers an hour. That is just beyond belief. Incredible. 